You know you're a millennial when big decisions like buying a flight ticket or sending an important email must be done on a laptop screen. Mm. But is it just a millennial thing or is that how we've been conditioned? Well, today we're going to take a look at the Huawei MatePad 12X and see if it's more than just a tablet and almost like a laptop. Now let's talk about the reasons why I choose my laptop for these big decisions. One is productivity and ease of use. Two is apps and the ability to just work very efficiently with all my apps running. And three is definitely the size of the screen. But on the other hand, a tablet does have more portability and durability and can also function almost like a laptop. So number one is productivity. Millennial me likes the idea of having a keyboard in front of her and having my elbows rest on the desk while I'm typing out my scripts and whatnot. Is that just not generally accepted to be more efficient? Like my 10 fingers can type quicker than my two thumbs can. I don't know, maybe it's just millennial logic. This Huawei MatePad 12X, like its predecessors, come with the Huawei Smart Magnetic Keyboard with Nearlink technology and is super lightweight and portable. So with this tablet, I do still get the sitting upright with a keyboard in front of me like experience and I'm able to rest my elbows on a desk too, especially while working on the go. So point one is millennial approved. Point number two, let's talk about apps and more specifically the WPS office because that's really where the Huawei MatePad 12X starts to feel like a laptop. And I'm so used to doing work on a laptop, so let's see if the MatePad 12X can also bring this PC-like functionality to a tablet. First up, I always need something to type out my scripts on, and since the MatePad 12X has PC-level WPS Office, I can use documents to type and format my script as I please. It also has a toolbar, which makes it more convenient for me, and it's just like what I typically see on my laptop. Next, I also use spreadsheets for all my claims and finances, which means I need to use formulas. So let's see if spreadsheet can do that. Ah, of course you can. You can also input pivot tables to help you analyze your data. And to wrap it up, I often get briefs in the form of presentations that I need to look through. So this is something that'll be especially handy for me to have open and switch back to when writing my scripts in documents. You can also do the usual slides, animation, and control presentations all from your MatePad 12X, just as you would on a laptop. Also, Huawei Notes adds to the tablet's appeal, letting you take notes, draw, and so much more. The Huawei M Pencil comes free with the tablet and offers 10,000 pressure sensitivity levels, so it feels like writing on paper. It's perfect for note-taking and even captures audio. Handy for students or anyone in a time crunch who can't write or type as fast as they think. That being said, I think point two is strongly millennial approved. Let's segue into point 2.5 and touch lightly on performance. So one of the main reasons why I gravitate towards my laptop more is because of how much RAM it has and the ability to run multiple programs at once and not tank my battery. So how does the Huawei MatePad 12X stack up? For starters, it's got 12 GB of RAM, which is more than most laptops nowadays, and also same as mine. Now about battery life. I don't wanna be attached to my charging cable while trying to work, so it's a good thing the MatePad 12X has a 10,100 milliamp hour battery. That's up to 14 hours of video playback and 12 hours of working, which is similar or could be even better compared to a laptop. And it has fast charging in just 85 minutes too. So I could go grab some lunch while it charges. For a tablet, point 2.5 is definitely up for debate depending on how heavy your tasks are. But I would say if you're just buying a flight ticket or replying to important work emails, you're good to go. No millennial pauses here. And lastly, point number three, which I think is the main reason why millennials have this preference for laptops in the first place, which is the size of the display. I don't know, it's something about like the bigger surface area and bigger font size, which maybe helps us see better or maybe not miss anything. And given that the MatePad 12X has a 12 inch paper matte display, which is only an inch smaller than my laptop screen, I don't think there's a valid argument here. Plus, paper matte technology offers anti-glare and reflection reduction, and us millennial girls, our vision is deteriorating from looking at screens for too long. So it's definitely a plus that the MatePad 12X has a lot of eye protection certification. Point number three, approved by this millennial. So did the Huawei MatePad 12X meet my expectations and can it replace my laptop? Well, I think that in many ways, it matches my laptop's capabilities. Plus, Huawei is offering generous freebies as always, including the M Pencil, Smart Magnetic Keyboard, Mouse, 
FreeBuds 5 backpack and one year screen break protection. There's also a 200 ringgit discount on e-commerce platform. Wonderful. With its PC level hardware, software, and all these extras, I expect the Huawei MatePad 12X to be about or under 3,000 ringgit, which is pretty much like getting a laptop at tablet price. Its big battery, large matte display, and performance does help challenge this millennial belief that important work must be done on a laptop. It's so portable, so durable, and mimics a real PC. So can we finally set aside our laptops and trust our tablets to do these important tasks? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Until next time, my name is Gwen, and let me know what you want me to take a look at next. Bye!